Hello there. A fabulous appearance is great for ourselves in daily life, but there are some interesting ways to have your cues appear even sexier than you ever imagined before. Let's start by making a sequence with cues based on some of our color presets. Label the sequence and open up an appearance pool. Let's create some appearances that reflect the colors from our color preset pool. Now we can assign an appearance to our sequence. But we can also assign an appearance to our individual cues. Let's assign the corresponding color appearance to the respective cue. In the sequence settings, we have the option to choose Prefer Cue Appearance. This option makes sure that when the cue is active, the appearance of the cue is displayed on our executor label. Let's broaden and widen our executor for more dramatic effect. If we now activate the sequence and go through the cues, we have created a great visual aid to see the content of our sequence. Another way of implementing this feature is for a position focus tag. Imagine a colleague of yours has to take over a show from you and has to update some position presets. He has not seen the show because we all have a real life and when we are not working we love to be at home. Of course, we want to have the same position presets as your original design intended. Let's add some appearances that contain a visual of the position presets we want to update. Now, we create a sequence that contains those position presets. Add the appearances to the respective cues. And again, let's make sure Prefer Cue Appearance is enabled. Assign the sequence and let's broaden the handle again. If the sequence is played back, we can see the intended position displayed. This will already help. An added bonus is that if you now select the fixtures that are used to create the look and adjust the pan tilt values accordingly, a simple push on the update button will automatically update the correct preset. Now how's that for smart and sexy? Happy programming!